13 Action News Update sponsored by Cox, bringing us closer. I'm Kalina Strinos and right now in your 13 Action News Update, kids in the Valley are now preparing to roll up their sleeves for the vaccine shot. Southern Nevada Health District will begin to administer vaccines to kids ages 5 to 11 starting today. State officials say Nevada is getting about 95,000 doses, which is enough for about one third of eligible children to get one shot. The man accused of shooting officer Shea Michelonis has pleaded guilty to all charges. Police say Edgar Samaniego shot officer Shea during protests last year in front of Circus Circus. Samaniego is being represented by a public defender. Now that shooting left officer Shea paralyzed from the neck down. He'll be honored for his bravery with the Purple Heart and Medal of Valor at Metro's Best of the Badge Gala happening this Friday at the Win. A very pleasant and above average day temperature wise for Southern Nevada. We're going to be landing in the mid 70s by the afternoon under plenty of sunshine and northeast winds staying right around 10 miles per hour throughout the day today. So less wind and more sunshine. Here's a look at that seven day planner. We're staying in those mid 70s for a couple of days here, but a gradual warming trend bringing us closer to 80 degrees as we head towards the weekend. We will see more sunshine, dry conditions, overnights falling into the mid 50s. The next chance of seeing some more fall like weather comes in the longer term. We will start a cool down trend as we work towards Tuesday and Wednesday, but still that'll bring us into the mid 50s with or excuse me, mid 70s with some moderate wind speeds expected. All right, Kelsey, thank you. You can always get the latest news at KTV.com, our KTV mobile app, our Roku channel and the latest version of Apple TV.